Good afternoon. Today, my group is going to present about the IRPC company. This company is about the oil company, company industry who engage in the petrochemical industry in the sea or Southeast Asia. IRPC revenue comes from four different sources such as the petroleum business, petrochemical refinery business, and tank and port, and asset management business. Also, as I mentioned that it, it is included in the petrochemical industry and its sector we catalyze it in the energy and utilities which engage in the refinery products such as the oil, diesel, fuel and like all plastic as well. And there are many competitors that that have uh, a lot of market share in the Thailand, such as the product of Exxon and many companies. This is the material that we gonna use it in our racial analysis. And the financial statement we catalyze into three categories, which is industry com competitive, trade and time series, and also cross sectional, and also with five main types of the financial ratio, which is the liquidity, the ability to offer to meet the debt obligation, and asset management, how well of the company to assess it, it asset and debt management, and also profitability and market value. First, we begin with the current ratio in the liquidity ratio. As you can see, that IRBC have higher ability to meet the short-term debt obligation when compared with the industry outlet. And you can see that in the IUUs in the year 2010 to 2012, and in year 2011, you can see that it has lower ability in liquidity, and, but they have higher in year 2012. For cross-sectional, I will use Portal and ESO as the competitor company to compare with the IRBC. As you can see that IRBC have higher ability than both of them. And also in the quick ratio, IRBC have higher ability as well, even they exclude their inventory. And it, it have the similar trend that it Ability is decreasing in year 2011 and increasing in the 2012. But you can see that Paratol has highest ability in year 2012 to meet the short term debt obligation. Obligation may exclude it inventory. For the inventory turnover, is made that uh, how will you gonna generate sales from your inventory? As you can see, that IRPC is much better than the industry overlays. And the ability in this ratio is increasing by, by each year. But as you can see, that IRPC is worse as the XOY protocol is the best one. For the accounting receivable turnover, is mean that how well of the company to convert the accounting receivable into the cash. As you can see, that IRBC is much better and it even better in each year. And it sees the second lag of more competitor. And the average collection period, the more, the more, the more number in this ratio is mean that we, this company take more time to convert the accounting receivable into the cash. So we can conclude that IRBC is more. The industry outlet is mean that it much worse than the industry outlet, and but it can cover the cover the debt into the cash with less time in every year. But when compared with the industry outlet, the portal is the best one to convert very fast. For the asset man management ratio, we begin with the total asset turnover is. The ability of the company to generate sales from its total asset. As you can see, that IRBC is 
lower ability to convert them. And but however, the IRBC has more more ability in this year. But when compared with the industry outlet, ESO is the ESO is the best one, and IRBC is the second leg, and Fortify is the worst. And for the big asset turnover is the hardware of the company to generate sell for its fixed asset. ARPC is the best among the industry outlet and it has more and more ability in every year. And it is the best among the product call and ESO. For the debt ratio in the debt management ratio, it means that how how proportion of the company use financial debt, the more of the value is mean that the higher financial method is mean that they have finance, more financial risk in the investor and stockholder perspective. And you can see that the RBC is less risky than the industry outlet because they use a lower debt. And but However, you can see that they use more debt in every year. When we, com when we compare the IRBC with the industry, you can see that it also higher. But for the debt to equity ratio, Apple. for the debt to equity ratio, it comes from the proportion of debt over the total equity. The more they use it, mean the more risky they are. So IRPC is much riskier than the industry ever And they use a lower debt finance financing in the year 2011, but higher in the 2012. When we compare with the protocol and ISO, IRPC is less riskier than the, the protocol and ISO. And for the profitability ratio, the gross profit margin is the uh, ability of firm to generate sales from its profit uh, to like to make sales. As we can see, that IRPC is lower ability than the industry outlet, and but it becomes better in every year. And also, but you can see that Parsa and ESO is much better because these two are much bigger firm than the IRPC. IRPC is just a small, well, it's private firm, so they cannot compare with the, the less two. And they also have a higher market share when compared with the IRPC. Also, the IRBC has less proportion of money left over from this revenue after deducted with cost of goods sold and cost of production than the industry outlet. And it performance is worsen in in every year. And we can say that for the tour, for the tour is the best one why IRBC has the equal ability as the SO. And the net profit margin is how well of the company to convert it net its its net income from the sale. And RBC is much lower than the industry level and the performance of them is worse than in every year. And also the the same as the previous one is gross profit margin as per far as the highest highest ability in this ratio. And for the return on assets is that IRBC has less ability to generate profit for this portal sale than the industry outlet. And also it's become worse than in every year. And her call is still maintain the first line in this ratio and IRBC is the second line for this ratio. And so is the worst. And return on the equity is mean that RBC is lower, so so they supposed to have less ability to make profit.
two is a step higher than when when compared with the industry everywhere. And RBC shareholders get a lower profit in every year. And Firefly is the best one, why and RBC is the second line. Right. And for PE ratio in the market value ratio, RBC is both which means that the stock price is higher than the industry average and its stock price is higher in every year. And but we can see that it quite fluctuates because in the year 2011 is increasing, but in the next year in 2012 is decreasing. But when compared with the industry, you will see that IRBC stock is expensive as SOI or thought is cheaper than, than both of them. And the renter share, IRBC is lower in the renter share when compared with the industry related. And IRBC, it, the renter share is lower and lower in every year. And IRBC has lower strong lowest among the competitor, among so and so and so on. And for the dividend yield, RBC has lower dividend yield compared with the industry average and become lower and lower in every year. Even just a uh, little bit increase in the year 2011, but dramatically decrease in the year 2012. For the dividend yield, RBC is the second largest higher dividend among the competitor while SO is the worst dividend yield. Thank you for your attention.